When you are working with hierarchical data, you can use hierarchical grouping to create reports that effectively display hierarchy structures. In this tutorial, you create a report based on a hierarchy field, and apply grouping and indentation based on that hierarchy field to effectively display the hierarchy structure. Note that this tutorial covers features available in SAP Crystal Reports for Enterprise, version 14.0.0, build R760 v2010-1019. To navigate, use the viewer controls or follow the on-screen instructions, if available. First, add a hierarchy field to the query. Click plus to expand the salesperson dimension. Double-click the salesperson hierarchy field. Select the desired members of the hierarchy to use in the query. Click Member Selector. Click Plus to expand Customer Type. Click Plus to expand Enterprise. Select the Enterprise checkbox. Click Plus to expand Large. Click Plus to expand Global. Select the Large checkbox. Select the Nancy Davolio checkbox. Select the Margaret Peacock checkbox. Click OK. Add any additional objects to the query. Double click order amount. Click Finish. Note that if you include a hierarchy field in a standard report table, the levels and members of the hierarchy are flattened into a standard column, making the results difficult to interpret. To create a report that preserves the structure of the hierarchy, it is recommended to group the report on the hierarchy field instead. Click the Structure tab, delete the existing objects from the report. You can hold down the control key to select multiple items. Select Salesperson. Press Control and select Order Amount. Press Control and select Delegated to Order Amount. Select Delete. Group the report on the Salesperson Hierarchy field. Right-click the Salesperson Hierarchy field. Select Group on Salesperson. Insert the order amount measure in the Group Header section of the report, rather than in the Body section. Click to drag and drop order amount in the Group Header section. Hide the Body and Group Footer sections of the report. You can hold down the Control key to select multiple items. Select the Body section. Press Ctrl and select the Group Footer 1 section. Right-click the selected sections. Select Hide. View the report. Click the Page tab. Note that the levels of the hierarchy are still displayed as a flattened column. Edit the group to add an indent for each level in the hierarchy. Right-click the Group Header 1 section. Select Edit Group. Click in the Group Indent text box. Type Decimal 5 and then click OK. Click to scroll down. The levels of the hierarchy are now indented. You have successfully applied hierarchical grouping. This is the end of the tutorial.